Praise the Lord, my beloved people all over the world. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the word of God, Garden and more. Today, what are you doing? What is mommy doing today? I'm showing off my, my pumpkins. Yeah, this one is a Japanese uh, kapocha pumpkin. Uh -huh. And uh, look at this one coming up. Yes, the heat, I tell you, has been doing some numbers on my plants, including this, my... Um, my uh, uh pumpkins and i have one here another one here this one is a uh, this one is a uh, uh, butterscotch yeah pumpkin mm -hmm. and uh, this one is turi red turi look at that mm -hmm. so a lot of them you know came up but they were aborted okay all over my my uh, the, the place. Look at. I planted, you know, some of this. Look, the same time I planted that, nothing has come out. Okay, so I'm going to check the the uh, the ones that worked in my garden. Okay, I have all, uh, them all over the place. So I don't know, but I'm sure this is ready because of this uh, this uh, because this place is brown. So what I I I, I did. I, uh, you know, to save it right, it doesn't fall off. You know, you can look at my my uh, video on my Cameroon pumpkin. Yeah, what I did, I I bought this from a uh, eBay, and I, I use it. You know, you, I, I didn't tie this because I was watching it, but you can tie it so that it will not fall off. So I put this net to protect it from uh, any pest. Then I, I I usually use this one and tie it permanently. Okay, all right. So you leave it there until it's ready. So as as it's growing, it's gonna be growing into it. Okay, like this one. It's a small one here coming up. See, that's what I I, I do. I will put this on on it to protect it. Okay, yeah. So as it's going, you know, you use this to connect it. You know, put it together. You sew it in, in and out, in and out. Then you anchor it right here on this uh, trellis. Okay, you make it permanently. So I'm watching it. As I'm watching it, I can tie it up. Okay, yeah. So that's what I did, even for for this one. See them? This ones I tied them up. Yes. Yeah. So yeah. So you see what I did? I put all of them in net. Even this one. I put it in the net yes so i'm looking at this whether it is time to harvest it or maybe i should wait a little bit longer i don't know this, this place is getting brown you know maybe i will leave it a little bit longer i was going to harvest it but I, i'm going to leave it okay so let me okay oh this one got aborted okay you see that is why I don't you know do it permanent so i'm going to put this back okay so i'll see when i will harvest it but at least let me show you all what happened so this uh kampocha worked very well japanese uh, uh, a pumpkin this one worked very well it grew and uh, you know although a lot of them came up but they got aborted i will take off that okay so yeah, so let's go. I will, I will do that another time. But at least you see, it's working very well. This one's, this one brought me about two. That one two about uh, about two. You know, some of them are coming up. I can see some coming up. Maybe if, when the weather is favorable, they will come up. I see some flowers, you know, coming up. Okay, yeah. So yeah, I thought I was going to harvest today, but no. I think I'll keep the harvest for another time. Okay, let me just show you around some of the, the ones. There's one up there. Look at one. That one didn't. That one came up, but you know. That one came up, but uh, it got aborted. Yeah, it grew. You know, it, it was right here, but it got rotten. I don't know what happened. So that's another type. Hopefully, you know, 
I'm still watering it, still feeding it. We'll see. And look at all the uh, the 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 leaves. I just the vine. It's just going going a while. Okay. Yeah. So yes. Look at uh, look at my okra. It's coming up. The best. I have a lot of okra now. I'm going to talk about that later. Okay. Uh huh. Yes, so I have some more pumpkin here. Look at, look at one pumpkin. So fun. I don't know whether we can see, but it's right here. Can you see it right here? Mm -hmm. There's one pumpkin there. Look at, right there. I was surprised one day when I came, I saw it because, you know, some pumpkin, pumpkin, a pumpkin will come up, they will get aborted, they will get aborted. I said, oh, I gave up on it. I wanted to, you know, um, you know, use the container, but I left it one day. I just look and I saw that uh, that is candy. Uh, uh, what is it called? Um, candy roaster. Roaster. Candy roaster. Yeah, it says a, a pink banana. They call it. All right. So this one, I don't know what this one is. Yeah, this one is a pumpkin, but I don't know what kind because what happened? I left it there uh, because you know I've already planted a lot of pumpkins, so I left it there. Try that, but. A lot of other ones dried up, but this one refused to dry up, so I now planted it. So when it comes up, we know what it is. All right, guys. So I tried the, the best I can. It's so hot. <laughs> I tried the best I can, as I can to, you know, show you all, uh, all the uh, uh, the pumpkin that I, I grew this year. This is the first time, and I, I see the one that I will try to grow again, like this uh, kapocha and uh, this uh, turi uh, red uh, kapocha and. Uh, the other uh, butterscotch so I know what I'm going to be planting because this one did very well I have other ones that I planted that I showed you guys that didn't do well even this one is still bringing up something look at I still have look at the pumpkin corner so if it's not aborted then you know you see that that is butterscotch is coming up so yeah so we thank God for everything you know uh, pumpkin you know if you check my uh, uh, the pumpkin that I default my first pumpkin I have two pumpkins actually. Um, the one from uh, Cameroon, you know, you see, I, I listed the, the head benefit. So uh, the, the the pumpkin leaves and the the pumpkin itself, you know, has a lot of uh, you know uh, good head benefit. Okay, it's very high uh, in a, and rich in a, uh, vitamin A. Okay, it has high antioxidant content that may reduce your risk of chronic disease. Is packed with vitamins that may uh, that they may uh, boost your immune system. Yes, along with other vitamins that is good for eye, it has vitamin A, like we said before, and other vitamin that I, ca I can't call their name. They, they protect your eyesight. Okay, uh, nutrient density and low calorie count may help promote weight loss. So it has a lot of uh, nutrient and very low in calorie, so it can help you with your weight loss the, the journey okay and uh, you know the the, the antioxidant uh, content may lower your risk of cancer okay and it has potassium vitamin c and fiber that may benefit head benefit the health of your heart okay so it contains compounds that promote healthy skin okay so yeah it's very easy to use you can you know incorporate it to your diet you know you can use it to do so many things uh, I have. I, you can use uh, uh, use use it for soap, for for lotion, for hair, uh, a shampoo, for so many things. For the skin, it's good for the skin too. Okay, it's good. You know, for soap. In fact, I was preparing to make a pumpkin uh, uh, soap. Okay, so it's very good. You know, you can use it for food. You can use it to saute. You can, you know, roast it in the oven. Very easy to use. You can just chop it, and uh, you know drizzle it with uh, some uh, olive oil put some thyme or whatever a little bit of uh, salt or whatever you use and you just put it in the oven voila you are ready to put it by the side of your meal or eat it by itself okay so yeah so this is uh, my pumpkin like this one they are very productive so I'm going to plant this again next year by God's grace yeah these uh, kampochas the, the Japanese ones yeah okay some of them I don't know maybe they will come up so I will let you know when it comes up okay so both the leaves and the 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 the, the, the pumpkin is very uh, nutritious the leaves also i listed the ones for the 
the fruit but the leaves also promote heart health okay and uh, if you have uh, arthritis rheumatoid uh, arthritis it can help you to elevate the, the symptom lower it okay it helps with uh, people that have a, a, pre, a, pre, a premenstrual syndrome P, a, P, a pms you know if you have a lot of problem pain and stuff okay and it can help you with to uh, retain data health okay so i think you can use that saute it or you can use it as as teas and and it might help to straighten up your bones it helps to fight colon cancer and the, the leaves also uh, support immune system and provide a, a supple and soft skin so it's good for your skin okay so that's good so you can use it you know incorporate it in your in your uh, way that we do uh, soaps and stuff you can incorporate it and use it and and if you are not the kind of person you can use it to cook look at like look at the leaves when they are fresh you can use it to you know make uh, some soups okay like you can do it with a goosey soup or whatever or you can you know make it to a uh, uh, with teas you know you make it uh, as teas i mean all right okay so look at the sun just the way the sun is dealing with all the leaves that's how it's dealing with us with that we're doing this video now <laughs> please please don't forget to give us thumb, thumbs up okay please and uh, become a family by subscribing they are all there thumbs up is right there give us thumbs up and subscribe okay support us all right as we bring you all these wonderful things support us okay so and god will support you as you do thanks for watching you all god bless us always shalom